idea is to grow the business without adding bricks and mortar and without adding bodies. So we really focus on the process. So when we looked at our OPS Ingersoll, we wanted to see how can we put more through the department without adding bodies, without adding bricks and mortar. So our solution was with PowerMill, we use an electrode package uh, called PowerShape. We can extract the electrodes using direct modeling tools and parasolids, which is much quicker than what they had before. And then PowerShape is also able to create these script files that contain volume of the electrode design, area of the electrode design, tool change. It's like night and day. Before, you had to, I would switch it to services, then I would make an area of solids, and then I would create a plane, and then I would extract it. And now it's just click, 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 done. We're going to look at an electrode that we've already made. We're going to pull it into the wizard. It also has an icon in the wizard that allows me to rotate my base holder so that it saves on carbon. I'm telling it that I want to use a 3R holder. We had PowerShape custom make a few items inside here so that it'll meet Cavalier Tools needs. The wizard allows us to get our VDIs, virtually all the information we need to burn. And then we use the custom script. Now that we've finished designing the electrode, we just simply pull it into power mill. It's already in cut position. It has a stock block made around it. And we've got a 39th tool station tool changer. We use our Renshaw probe to probe the job, just load the machine and go. Once these files are created, all the user has to do is load the electrode here with the system 3R holder and load the ING file to the machine and that's it. The machine knows where to go in XYZ, knows the C-axis rotation, knows the burning location, and this is all being done through PowerShape. We're roughly between about three to five times faster than our current process. We went from outsourcing about $600,000 a year in EDM to pulling that back in with a single machine. It's fantastic. The cost savings in the electrode, the labor and the handwork, the throughput of the machine far outweighs the payment. So I'm of the opinion I'm not buying the machine. The productivity paid for it.